business as usual is not a good future for us as a globe and not a good future for us as Australians. So we got to shift it. We got to shift what that future is to something that we want to happen. We really need government to play an important role here. The regulatory framework is critical. We need certainty, consistency, and sometimes this is going to involve market redesigns and changes in required laws. We are a big part of the problem. And it's a scary thing to admit, but we really are when it comes to, if we look at emissions as a starting point, we are one of the leading industries in the world when it comes to emitting carbon. I think we have a huge responsibility. We're the originators of products. We're the ones that come up with the ideas. Um, if we don't take responsibility for those products over their life cycle, then really who will? It's not about sustainability sitting off to the side as an adjunct. It's about figuring out how we embed um, sustainability into our business. All kinds of things that we throw away in terms of our waste glass, our textiles, our batteries, all of these important materials actually can be reformed and put that towards production. For the major parties to look coal communities in the eye and say coal is finished, within 10 years we will not be digging any more coal up. We are now going to work with you to come up with the alternatives. There are interests out there who do not want change. Why is that? Because they are benefiting from the current system. Every time we throw food, surplus organic produce into landfill, it gives off methane gases. The easiest, the lowest hanging fruit is if each and every one of us did not waste our food. We have the technology now to do things. We have the resources in Australia. We have the ability to be leading the world in climate action, and yet we're not doing it. Australia, after 30 years of being a climate pariah, has strangely the opportunity to leap to become first in the world, to get the gold medal in decarbonisation. That brings me to the things that we must do today, which is electrifying our lifestyles. It has to be all of us. All together. Every one of us. Acting together. To collaborate. It is our world. And we all need to be doing something about it now. It's through that collective alliance that together we can all do this. Let's get on with it.